What's happening, Pogi fam? It's Wednesday. I'm excited. I found some more Shining Fates to open. We got the Cramorant V10 right here. And as always, we're going to have a Darkness Ablaze binder update after this. Now, this is going to be the second to last Darkness Ablaze opening on the channel until it's reprinted at the end of this year. If Pokemon sticks to their agreement with their tweets saying that they want to help get more product back on the shelves that they know everyone didn't have a chance to get their hands on. So let's break in to this Cramorant tin, see if we can find some more shinies, such an awesome set, and then we'll see what we can add to the Darks of Blaze binder. Let's do it. All right, Cramorant tin. I am so excited to open this, you guys. A bunch of my friends have been getting some of their best pulls from these tins. Really awesome that you get six packs. Oh, that's a great sound. Pull this off here. Six packs instead of the usual five in a tin like this. You get this awesome shiny V promo. Could be Bolton, uh, Cramorant, or Eldegoss. Six packs, the promo, and your code card. Let's do it. Kind of sad that we're going to be out of Darkness of Blaze pretty soon here to open two. It's been one of my favorite sets. Oh, this Cramorant V promo is so cool. Let's take it out. Bam. Got some sleeves here. Look at that. Pretty good print on it too. The centering isn't awful. A little, uh, little short on the top compared to the bottom. And here is code card for you. Bam. All right, let's leave this guy up and let's start the hollow holder off with a shiny V, even if it's a promo. We'll start it off with that. All right, and six packs of Shining Fates. This tin is one of the Shining Fates products that I am the most excited to open. But, you know, the reality is it's all kind of random, you know. Somebody's going to pull the Zard from the pin box. Somebody's going to pull one from the tin. Somebody's going to pull one from an ETB. That's just the way it goes. All right. Bam. So many or so few common cards in this set, Psychic Energy, that we've already seen a lot of them. Rusted Shield, more Pico, more Peko, Choodle, Eevee. Love that Eevee artwork. Corsi, Cacnea. All right. We've got amazing rare Reshiram on the first pack out of the Cramorant V10. Now today, I'm not gonna put the baby shinies up on the wheel, but this guy is definitely going up there. So cool, now I've got a Japanese and an English amazing rare Reshiram. What's behind Reshiram? All right, non-holo Celebi. Let's pop it in a sleeve. And we're already adding, oops, to the holo holder on pack number one so cool as always got the vmax zard sleeves ready to go just in case all right dragapult what have you got for us remember that weird uh just chomped up card that i pulled out of that etb i'm curious if we're gonna see other weird miscuts like that metal energy rusted sword let's go Let's get through these commons. Too many of the same commons coughing. Trap engine in the sand, rally. And all right, reverse Morpeko. Non hollow bull canyon for our rare. We gotta have a couple hits in this tin. We gotta have more than just a Reshiram. All right. Sort of quicker openings this week, Pokey fam. I'm moving across town to a bigger place and I'm going to have an entire room for the channel with all my collection. I'm going to be putting some shelves together. It's going to be really fun, really excited for this next week. Ball guy, rusted sword, more Pico, more Peko, Choodle, Nicket, Champion's Path, get out of here, Grookey, Yanma, Score Bunny, we're starting to double up on the baby shinies. Now, like I said, we won't pop all the babies up on the wheel this time. Look at that awesome Score Bunny artwork. What do you got behind you? A hollow Indeedy, kind of cool. It's pretty cool there, a little Indeedy artwork. All right, Score Bunny, baby shiny, going in the sleeve. 
unreal. Over a hundred shinies in Shining Fates. Kind of wish they would have put a little more effort into the title there, but Shining Fates is cool enough, right? All right. Two packs left after this one. And then we'll see what we can add to the Darkness Ablaze binder. Like I said, going to be really sad to see Darkness Ablaze go for a little bit, but hopefully Pokemon sticks with their promise and reprints all of these sets that a lot of people missed out on over the last year. Rotom. Float Zeal, Cacnea, Gosslefleur, Snom, Snom, Trapinch, Nick it again, go. Professor's Research and ah, non hollow bosses, orders. All right. Cramorant V10. Do you have more than an amazing rare Reshiram and a Score Bunny? I think you do. I think you do. Code card bam what kind of pull rates are you guys getting on these code cards always curious man look at just some lightning too like right off the bat on these not the greatest not the greatest printing here rusted shield team yell towel i really want them to make a, a yell towel i would totally buy one of those if i saw that in pokemon center choodle eevee Reverse Morpico again, and a non hollow bosses orders. All right, it all comes down to you, Charizard Pack. Still think these tins are awesome. Really cool that you grab a shiny V as the promo. I want to kind of go for, I don't know if I'd go for a master set of Shining Fates. That seems pretty crazy, you know, unless they really print it at the level they're saying they're going to, that would be very, very pricey to go for right now, even at retail. But I'm definitely excited to start putting the binder together and just try to get all of the shinies. All right, Tropius, it's our last pack. I'm always curious if I see something or if it's just the, the edge of the card there. Shinx, coughing, trap inch. Reverses a dart tricks and what have you got? Hollow in DD. So we got burned on the Cramorant tin. Not the greatest pulls. Let's do a quick little recap and then we'll jump into the Darkness of Blaze. So Baby Score Bunny, amazing rare Reshiram, and the the what's it hollow? The Shining Cramorant V. Very very cool. Let's leave these up on the hollow holder, just so it's not empty there. And let's do four of the last eight packs for the Darkness Ablaze binder. Now, if you've been watching this from the start, either this box is just super unlucky or all the pulls are coming in these last few packs here because we've only had a couple, couple hits. Oh, green code, green code, what do we got? Bunnelby, Vanellite, Amphros, Flygon for our reverses. Now we actually have all of the regular cards in this set. We're just looking to finish the V Maxes and the secret rares that I'm missing. All right, send a scorch. What have you got? Still a chance for a V Max Zard out of this box. I would be very happy. All right, code card. Got to remember which way the codes are facing. Two, three, four, to the front. Metal Energy, Kabu. Turbo Patch, Dartrix. Turbo Patch Gold was the first gold that I pulled when I got back into collecting. How cool is that? Galarian Darmaka, Sentret. I feel like I see something behind this spinner rack. What do we got? Hollow Tyrant Tyranitar. Finally, one of the last hollows that I was missing for this set. Really was wondering how long it was gonna take me to pull one of those. This guy will be going into the binder for sure. We got two packs left here. Eternatus. I feel like the uh, Grimmsnarl pack artwork is just what I've had the best uh, pulls from. But it's different for everybody, right? It's random. Four to the front. Let's go fire energy. Oh, oh. Bird Keeper, Soul Rock. Got a Relin Clan, Snoobal, Melt Hand, Bunnelby, Psychedelic Bunnelby, Paris, Larvitar. We've got our reverse 
steamy, steamy, and a butterfree VMAX doubling up on the VMAXs out of this box. I'm happy about it. Butterfree is one of my favorite Canto mods. So awesome. Tossing Butterfree up on the wheel. Very, very cool. Let's leave this Butterfree up. I knew all the pulls were coming from the back of this box. We got through the front with hardly anything. Get you up on the hollow holder. All right, and now over the next couple videos, we'll have some more Shining Fates and the final Darkness Ablaze opening. But for now, Grim Snarl, what have you got for us? Can we add something besides the Tyranitar to the binder today? I'm really excited to have that complete Darkness Ablaze binder. All right, code card. Here we go, here we go. Can we make another VMAX Zard up here? Soul Rock, Relin Clan, Yellhorn. Oh, we're out of focus. Ducket, Marip, Paris. I feel like I see something. Scar Marie, I need to stop saying that. Reverse Pessimian, and we've got Sizor V. We're adding to the binder for sure this week. I know this is one that I've been missing. Very, very awesome. Let's put this up on the wheel. Not the greatest centering. A little off on the left to the right. Not the worst though. Very, very cool. Let's sleeve this guy up. Let's check through the pulls and see what we added to the binder this week. Bam. And bam. All right guys, so it looks like we were able to add two cards to the binder this week. I'm gonna be really sad to see Darkness Ablaze go, but it should be back at the end of this year. As always, if you enjoyed this video, Poke fam, drop a like, drop a sub, I post a new video every Wednesday and Saturday, but until then, be safe, have fun, keep collecting, and I'll see you in these next videos.